A guilty verdict in a major Santa Fe trial that has gotten international attention for what it says about the movie industry. Jurors say the woman in charge of weapons on the Rust movie set is responsible for a deadly 2021 shooting that killed cinematographer Helena Hutchins. News 13's Marilyn Upchurch was in the courthouse for that verdict. She's live this evening at Santa Fe District Court. After 10 days of testimony and nearly 40 witnesses, it took jurors just over two hours to reach a verdict, finding Hannah Gutierrez guilty of involuntary manslaughter. We find the defendant, Hannah Gutierrez, guilty of involuntary manslaughter as charged in count one. We find the defendant, Hannah Gutierrez, not guilty of tampering with evidence as charged in count two. Gutierrez did not immediately react to the verdict, but her relatives did, sitting in the front row behind her, learning she would be immediately taken to jail. Prosecutors convinced jurors that as an armorer, Gutierrez was ultimately responsible for live ammo that made it on set. A real bullet was unknowingly loaded into a gun actor producer Alec Baldwin was handling, which was eventually shot at cinematographer Helena Hutchins, who died. Gutierrez's defense, in part, blamed the producers for the shooting, claiming they rushed production and created a dangerous environment, but jurors did not buy it. That was her job to check those rounds, those firearms, and if no one wanted to pay attention or do that, then she could stop the work. We're obviously disappointed in the verdict, but we are disappointed in a lot of things that happened in that courtroom. We plan to appeal. We believe we've got a number of issues that we will be asserting. Gutierrez now faces up to a year and a half in prison. Her sentencing is expected to take place sometime next month. And meanwhile, actor producer Alec Baldwin is also expected to be tried for involuntary manslaughter later this year. Back to you. All right, Marilyn, thank you. Gutierrez was found not guilty of a more serious third degree felony charge of tampering with evidence. Prosecutors claim that Gutierrez got rid of drugs after the shooting.